You are getting a live look inside Northern Guilford High School where parents, students and school leaders are gathering for a fentanyl town hall. Organizers want everyone to know the potentially deadly consequences of drugs. Nearly 90% of students at Northern say drugs are a problem at their school. The problem is impacting lots of schools. Experts say more young people are getting involved with dangerous drugs. WFM News 2's Hannah Jeffries is on campus tonight with a closer look at the problem. Hey, Hannah. Students here at Northern Guilford acknowledged drug usage is a problem in a recent survey, and that is the reason for this meeting tonight where they're hoping to spread awareness and keep drugs off of this campus. Kathleen Smith is passionate about this topic as a mom of two and PTSA member. She wants to make sure her kids and their classmates are safe. She says her daughters have talked to her about students coming to class high or using drugs in school. People used to smoke in their car and get in the schools and it'd be fine. Or maybe it was an occasional in the bathroom. I think the students are realizing it's so brazen now. It's happening in the back of classrooms. It's happening in classroom changes. And I think they're kind of annoyed with it. Within the past decade, the Guilford County Health Department has seen a 200% increase in drug overdose deaths. Emergency services say they work to stop those deaths, administering things like Narcan. They sometimes see people under the age of 18 in need of help, too. We see impacts from the opiate crisis just throughout the community, so it does impact Younger folks, just the same way that it, it impacts everyone within the community. Um, we see some influence there, but it really, it does impact people across um, age range and socioeconomic and geographical ranges as well. The Greensboro Fire Department administered Narcan to three people under the age of 18 last year alone. Organizers of this event tell me that they hope this sparks the conversation between parents and students about the dangers of using drugs. Live in Guilford County, I'm Hannah Jeffries, WFMY News 2.